Well, there is nothing to whine about these days in Temecula's wine country. Yeah, call it grape expectations, Kathleen. Despite the recession, the region is making bold moves for its future. Napa, it is not, but the Temecula Wine Valley is experiencing something the much bigger, better known wine region to the north isn't growth. <laughs> Buzz saws echo through the relatively unscathed Temecula Valley these days as crews work to construct 11 new wineries. We've had wineries come in over the last 25 years, one, two here, three there, but not the push that we've had lately. The construction, part of a growth spurt that locals claim recently made Temecula the biggest wine region in all of Southern California. The recession is actually having a mixed impact on business here in Temecula. For one thing, those 11 wineries that are under construction, well, things have slowed down a little bit. But for the existing wineries here, business lately booming. Temecula's Wine Growers Association says the area's 35 wineries have noticed a 20% increase in visitor traffic in the last few months, 60% of which are from San Diego. For some reason, we have not been hit as bad as some of the other wine regions or as some of the other tourism industries have been. The reasons for the increased traffic? Well, for one, there's more respect for the wines produced here. The area's South Coast Winery recently named Winery of the Year, a first for Southern California. We've got these wines that are very credible and are capable of competing. And Temecula tour operator Adam Hall cites another reason for the increased business. They couldn't afford to go to Hawaii or um, Cabo San Lucas or their, their typical trip. Um, so they're trying to save a little bit of money, but they would like to get away. In the meantime, the people in Napa report that visitor traffic is down about 15 to 20 percent for them this year. Temecula officials say the unique pro proximity that they have to Palm Springs, Los Angeles, and of course San Diego, allowing them to benefit. We'll see how long that continues. Kathleen. It's nice to see uh, actually business booming somewhere these days, that's for sure.